so I'm pretty sure nobody enjoys going to the dentist. Personally, I know I don't jump out of bed in the morning and think, yes, I get to go to the dentist today. Woohoo! And for sure, I don't look like this guy when I'm there either. But I know dental care is important for us humans, and it's just as important for our cats as well. It's thought that as many as 85% of cats aged 3 years and older have some sort of dental disease. Even though you think your cats may be fine and have no problems with their teeth, they're very good at hiding pain and most dental disease occurs below the gum line where you can't even see it. Plaque forms on your cat's teeth every day. If the plaque isn't removed within a couple of days, it hardens into tartar and eventually causes periodontal disease. Signs of periodontal disease include bad breath, abnormal chewing, drooling or dropping food, a reduced appetite, and changes in their behavior. Early detection and treatment is critical because advanced periodontal disease can cause severe problems for your cat, including kidney, liver, and heart muscle changes. So the bottom line is, we as cat servants need to do the best we can to help prevent dental disease in our cats. Obviously, most cats don't enjoy having their teeth brushed, but this is the single most effective way to keep your cat's teeth healthy. In an ideal world, you would have introduced them to this when they were just kittens, so as adults they would just see it as another part of their everyday lives. But when you have kittens and younger cats, the thought of dental disease doesn't even cross your mind, just like with us. So with adult cats, you have to take the time to get them used to this new daily annoyance. Here's how we started our dental care routine. Firstly, you just want to get them used to being touched around their mouth, teeth and gums. So wherever you are, when you're petting them like normal, just work your way over to their mouth and lift their lips a little. Then rub your finger around their teeth and gums. Nothing extensive, just do this whenever you have the opportunity and remember to give them lots of praise Good during boy. and after. Good boy. Once they're used to this, you can add some toothpaste to your finger and do the same thing. It's important to use cat toothpaste that's designed to be swallowed and has special enzymes that help clean their teeth. They come in all different cat friendly flavors and a lot of cats don't actually mind the taste. Do not use regular human toothpaste. This isn't safe for cats and if swallowed can cause internal problems. Take your time and don't rush. Okay, so now your cats are more used to you wanting to mess around with their mouths, it's time to introduce a toothbrush. There's lots of brushes out there designed for cats that you can find in pet stores and online. And there's even finger toothbrushes too. We found that these toothbrushes for human babies have soft bristles and work best for us. You all know what works best for you and your cat. With cola and marmalade, instead of putting them on my lap, I found that the easiest way to brush their teeth is to kneel down behind them so they can't back away, and instead of using their claws on my legs, they can dig into the rug if they feel like it. Introduce the brush slowly and make sure to get the back teeth. You don't need to brush their teeth for 2-3 to three minutes like us, I'm normally done after around 30 seconds. What's important is that you're doing it. Even if you only manage 5 seconds before your cat really lets you know it wants to be done, 5 seconds is better than nothing and you can gradually increase this a little each day. Remember, it's tough love time. Most cats aren't going to enjoy this at first, or ever, but it's for their own well-being. Obviously, daily brushing is best, but not always possible. There's also gels that act like a kitty mouthwash, dental wipes, water additives, treats and diets that can all be used to help. With gentleness, patience and perseverance, it is possible to brush your cat's teeth and provide the oral care needed to prevent dental disease. And I like to do it in the morning to get it out of the way, and then I can spend the rest of the day trying to win back their affection. Go on, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All cats should have annual checkups at the vet, so along with everything else, their teeth and gums can be inspected too. And if necessary, a professional cleaning can be scheduled. Some cats, just like with people, tend to have worse teeth than others, and no matter what you do, genetics is a determining factor. Marmalade is FIV positive, and unfortunately regular cleanings will be part of his life. As you can see, instead of being nice and white, his teeth have some tartar buildup, and his gums, which should all be pink, have some redness. Under anaesthesia, vets can carefully clean his teeth, and more importantly, clean under his gums, which will give us a good base to start from again to keep his teeth clean for as long as possible. So hopefully this video has given you a good basic knowledge of what we do to help care for Cola Marmalade's dental health, and will inspire you to want to do the same for your cats at home as well. Thanks for watching.
Where is it? 